morning, Hopkinton High School. I'm Matthew, and welcome to another edition of HHS Today. We hope you all had a great Thanksgiving break and keep your focus going at least until December vacation because that's still too far away. But our first segment today is from the Multimedia Club, who sat down for an interesting chat with the AP Lang teacher, Mr. Franschock. Here comes the slap. All right, what is up, guys? Welcome to the first segment of HHS The Slap. I'm your host, Taz, bringing you an interview with Mr. Franchock, the AP language teacher for Hopkinton High School. How are you doing, Mr. Franchock? Good, thanks, Taz. So uh, I want to talk to you about Franchonia. Obviously, it's been coming to an end for a lot of your classes. Um, and for those of you who don't know what Franchonia is, it's the political simulation but done by students in AP English at Hopkinton High School. All right, so uh, with the presidential elec election that has happened this year, did you notice anything different with this year's Franchonia in comparison to previous ones? Yeah, I did actually in a couple different ways. Um, I really noticed a lot more negative ads actually that the kids made this year compared to previous years. And we always have some, but that seemed to be a very normal thing this year more so than other years. Politics can be really tense, so why politics for Franchonia? Well, uh, on the AP language exam, uh, politics and economics are the two topics that come up the most. So um, do you have anything to say to the underclassmen that are thinking about taking AP language this uh, next year? Oh, well, I hope they do. Um, we have, you know, we've had our class grow a lot uh, over the last, well, I guess it's been 13 years I've been doing this class and uh, we've grown from my first year was something like 17, 18 people took Lang and we, you know, we're over 80 now. Wow. I mean, it's been a big change. Um, so. You know, it, it, I think it's a good class. I think it's uh, fun. Uh, obviously, uh, you know it's hard work, um, right. but uh, I like to think students you know, learn a lot from it. All right, well, that'll be it. Uh, thank you so much, Mr. Franchock, okay, for doing this interview. Thanks. We'll see you guys later. If you'd like to get involved with Franchonia, you can take AP Lang next year, Jones for Franchonia 2016, and that was just a portion of the full interview. To see it all, watch this episode on our webpage, HCAM tv slash hhs tv coming up next we have a regular segment minute with the principal hello hopkins and hi and welcome to a minute with the principal this is a very busy time of year and i encourage you all to take a breath and just be mindful of all that you've been given and the ways that so many of you have been giving back i am very proud of what hopkins and high has and continues to accomplish in our community don't let that pass by in a blur enjoy these experiences okay great now Rogue One is coming out December 16th. Have you got your tickets? If not, what are you waiting for? Here's what I want you to do. Send me an email with no more than 10 words telling me what's the best Star Wars movie in your opinion. 10 words. And I'll report back on the next minute with the principal on what's the best Star Wars movie. Until then, and every day, be kind to one another. Thanks, Mr. Bishop. Okay, looks like we're up to our question of the day. This week we asked, what is your favorite possession? Check it out. What is your most favorite thing that you own? Actually, the only thing that I have any sense of possession about is myself. My dog, Buster. My phone, because I can communicate with my friends and family. Definitely this little like ceramic avocado in my room, and it like opens up, and it's just an avocado, and I really like it. Uh, my grandfather on my dad's side does carvings, and one time for one of my birthdays, he uh, carved this painting that I really like, and it's actually really beautiful. Um, my beanbag chair. It's definitely my lawnmower. My lawnmower, yeah. <laughs> it's my lawnmower. <laughs> my family. <laughs> my fish. And my chickens. I love my chickens. What is your most... All my trophies for my uh, powder puff wins. My powder puff jersey. Footballs. My, my teammates. <laughs> Our tortilla chips. <laughs> In case you're wondering, mine is my dog. And finally, we have our Have You Seen This segment. Last week's photo was from one of the murals in the third floor academic hallway. I guess it was a tough one because no one got it. All right, better luck next time. Here's this week's photo, Have You Seen This? Email us at hhstv at hillers.org or Snapchat us at HHSTV Snaps. And you could be the winner of a limited edition candy-filled water bottle. So get looking. That's it for this week, folks. But before we go, we'd like to hear from you. Do you know of someone doing something cool or has an interesting hobby? What about a school club activity or event you'd like to get the word out about? Or have you thought about HHS TV and maybe want to be part of the action here? Just drop us an email and we'll tell you all about it with no pressure. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. We'll leave you with some backstage footage from the production of Pippin. 
I'm just like, sort of like, I'm about to take off my leggings and I'll take like, Whoa, camera. <laughs> Younger step siblings were like, 